Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Susie, and if you're new here, I do lots of DIY thrifting thrift flips that I sell in my retail booth. Today I am at my booth. It's Friday. I just got off work. We're about to go in and revamp my booth to get it ready for the new product that I'm selling, Iron Orchid Designs. Now, mom's been here for a little while before me, so we're gonna go on in and see what she's got done, and then I'll tell you what we're gonna work on there. Thank y'all for watching my videos, and I just wanna tell you guys that I appreciate you, and I hope that you enjoy this video. She's up on the ladder. Hey! So, looks like she's got all the walls emptied and she's got the pegboard up. Uh, everything piled in a pile. Yep. We'll have to get everything back in order. Looks like not very much stuff when it's all piled up in one spot, don't it? It's a lot. It's a lot it's of a lot. stuff. There's basketfuls of stuff, trays full of stuff. Uh, stuff stacked on top of stuff. <laughs> it's just a lot of stuff. Yeah, I see. Yeah beautiful though. Uh, I need to make sure and take that um, ball jar home. Oh, it's got rust yeah, in it. Yeah, come off those, uh, that, those utensils or something. Well, they weren't that bad when I put I them know. in there. I know. I just noticed it when I took it down. Huh. So I need to take that home. And I don't it. know. People like the rusty home. stuff. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, they didn't get that one though. They bought all the blue ones. Yeah. But not that one. The two, the yeah. two clear ones. Yeah. yeah May there's have to. a lot of stuff. We, I just consolidated it a yeah. lot. Okay, so. so my plan is to paint that wall black for the IOD stuff. Is it and the same black as this, Sus? Yeah. Is this the same black? Okay. Mm -hmm. I was yeah. wondering that. And then Sorry. I'm going to paint, go ahead and paint that wall white. I never really have like that wood color anyway, so. Yeah, that pine is kind of yellowish. Yeah. So, and then we're going to rearrange tomorrow and hey, and get all the stuff displayed and just get it going again. Yeah, with the color of the packaging mm -hmm. on your, mm -hmm. what is that called? I can't remember. Iron Orchid Designs. Iron. Yeah, yeah. Like or IOD is for short. I knew it was IOD, but I couldn't remember what the O was. Oh. I think I think I mm -hmm. Okay, we can call it. I had remembered to bring the drills, the paint, the pegs, all that stuff I would need, but I did forget to bring me a change of clothes, so here I am in my work dress, and it's just about there that I realized that I got white paint on it, so luckily I just realized I don't like the way that dress looks on me watching me on film, so I will not be wearing it anymore. We painted this one white and this one black and we're about to go home. Bye guys, see you tomorrow. And we'll be back here tomorrow to finish up. Guys, we're back at the booth today and when we left it last night at closing time, we had just painted these two walls. We're about to bring a big piece of furniture in and rearrange and get this place set back up and ready to go.
we had to have a little discussion on the best way to get this in there. No argument, just a little discussion. you to do while you're here is steady those things up there steady what, those walls together what I was thinking is to toenail that two by four into that other two by four at the top oh where is it tied there yeah huh. me and Allison zip tied it because that's all we had here I'm going to do this I know yeah. I've got a drill and I've got a bit to drill a hole but Working with this much stuff in a small space can be kind of challenging. Seems like you move things around two or three times just to get them out of the way and then put them where they go. But we're getting it arranged. I decided to put the baker's rack over here on the outside so we could hang my sign on the back of it and get the mirror out where we could be it could be seen. And then I put my crates and my table beside it. And now we're just going to work on putting everything presentable. Um, this will be tweaked a lot on and off, but for right now, we're about to get it at least where it can be shown. And people always tend to buy more when I rearrange things. So it's a good idea to do this every now and then. Just move things around some, create some small little vignettes and such. Also remember that this is a Saturday morning, which happens to be the only day of the week that I ha am able to do this kind of thing. So we're also getting customers a lot and we just stopped to talk to them. I think that was actually a repeat customer that bought something yesterday and she's wanting to look at several things as we're putting them away that she just didn't notice yesterday. So that's another reason to rearrange sometimes. People just don't see things until you move them.
So I can't believe that this mirror hasn't sold yet. Um, so we put it out front here, hopefully that it will. And I put my sign here where you first walk in, you see it. And then I have my crates here with stuff displayed on them. Um, there was quite a few things that just weren't selling and people didn't seem interested in. So we made just a little dollar basket here to see if those things can get gone. redid the wall and it's white now. And then I barely had enough room for all the IOD stuff and I had to stack stuff kind of on top of each other, but we got it there. And I brought in this China cabinet um, that I painted. And you know, if it sells, I can always expand that area out some. But for now, I've got everything displayed, almost everything. I have a few new items at home that don't get released for, till the 18th. Thank you for watching my video of my booth reset. I know it was hectic. The next few videos will probably be thrift flips with the new IOD releases. And I can't wait to share that with you. Hope y'all come back and I hope you have a great day.